So I will go right in with my square for the week. I would be playing Alvin Kamara. This is a player that, you know, he's had a lot of the injury tags and the two games he's played this year. Um, you know, PPR leagues, he hasn't gotten you more than seven or eight points. You've been very disappointed this far. I think with a lot of the question marks in the game being over in London, being really early, you might not be up to set your lineup. People might be worried, but I wouldn't be, right? Um, I think with Alvin Kamara, usually I'm all about the numbers, but I'm going to play a little bit more of a narrative and why I'm absolutely keeping in my starting lineup. I think Alvin Kamara is a big time player. He's had big performances on a national stage, um, prime time type games in the past. I think over the country and a team that's really absolutely going to need him. He's going to be a kind of a go-to guy, a standout type player. Um, you know, Winston is, he's had two DNPs in practice so far this week as of recording. Um, and his, you know, he's, he's flying overseas with a bad back. I'd be very nervous about James Winston. There's a really good chance that he doesn't even start. And if he doesn't start, Alvin Kamara is absolutely wheels up in games without James Winston. He averages 104 yards, uh, just under a touchdown and just under seven targets a game. That's a 63 game sample size. And with Winston, he's 88 yards, just under a touchdown and five targets in a 12 game sample size. So he, his numbers and splits have been significantly better. I know it was Drew Brees, but he has been better, not with Jameis Winston. There has been other quarterbacks in there for, for a bit. And even if Jameis is in there, if he, if his back is that bang and he just got off the plane, um, you know, I think Alvin Kamara will be a guy that they lean on, especially with Michael Thomas questionable, uh, not a hundred percent this week as well. And there's been no indication from reports that I've seen that Alvin Kamara should miss this game. And he's not limited in any way other than pain. Cause you know, when you hurt your ribs, it's just a pain tolerance thing. It's a miserable injury, but it's one he can certainly play through, especially with modern medicine. I can expect that too, that the, with Jameis's, Jameis is back. He's going to want to get the ball up pretty quick. And Kamara is definitely capable of handling those roles or that duty. Yeah. 